nothing else. Oh, right, we had to go into this place. Now I remember. Okay. Before we do that, let's, um... Going to the park, that's the plan. You shouldn't. It's called purgatory for a reason. Your soul gets stuck there. What do you mean? The place is cursed. Once a man falls down, the rush of falling becomes more enticing than the struggle of getting back up. And once you felt the thrill of the underworld, the land of the living, seems dull. So I'm warning you now. Stay out. I have no intention of falling down. Just paying someone a visit. It's your funeral. Either way, take care. Okay. Oi. Hey, you. Yeah, you, buddy. Hold up. Cool. Eh? What is it? I got some caps for my PS4 controller last week that I haven't really taken the time to play with. So I might be swapping these around a little bit throughout the night. <laughs> this here's a toll road, buddy. You want to get through here? You got to pay. You got to pay the toll. You got to pay the troll toll. You're the toll collector, huh? That's right. It usually costs 5,000 yen, but since it's Christmas... That means I gotta add the holiday tax. Today it's gonna cost you 10,000 yen. But, I do offer a no cost option if you're interested. Oh yeah? Tell me more. <laughs> you just gotta defeat me. I figured as much. It's actually my recommendation. Since everyone forks over the cash, I'm a little out of shape. So what'll it be? Pay the toll? Pay up a fight? Put up a fight or turn around like a wimp? really hope I gotta punch him and he turns into Majima. Nice, nice. It's been a while since someone with some balls came through here. Bring it on. I'm gonna enjoy this. Oh. You're a little beefier than I expected. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I hear your fucking bicycle kicks, Liu Kang. Let me just go ahead and real quick. Oh god, do I have 22 points? Holy shit. Uh, so first off, let's uh, let's get some of that health back. Uh, secondly, let's go ahead and spend these points. Holy shit. Steel fortitude. Is that anything? Steel gut. Or boost attack. I can take a significant health buff, which would lead to health recovers when I drink booze. As well as another health buff and Herculean Fist. Uh, let's go ahead and take that, actually. Oh my god. 
Oh, I'm so fucking rusty right now. That's not what I wanted to do. Fucking pick things up in this style. Off to a great start. Oh, you're lucky there's not a bicycle around here. There we go. That's the money shot. Learn something today? Maybe it's time to stop taxing public roads like a troll. What was that? If you can't speak up, maybe you'd like to go another round. Consider it a Christmas present. No, I get it. I'll stop doing this. Please forgive me. That's what I thought. Merry Christmas. <sighs> thought everyone in this town was all talk and no walk. But you're the real deal. You know I did learn something today. Turns out there are people in the world who are even stronger than me. Here, I figure I owe you this. Leech gloves! Looks like I better go back to training, and I'm confident I can defeat you. I'll come back to this town. Until then, farewell. You can come back whenever you want, but when you do, you better not be taking money from people. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Remember a guy used to train with the money he got from Shake Down on these streets? Time marches on, people change, but the schemes they dream up are always the same. What are leech gloves? Great abilities. Gloves are said to increase your heat by draining your opponents when you attack. Can 
Well, they're better than what I have on, so we'll go with it. Alright. I'm gonna stop by that phone booth and replenish my supplies of uh, health items. Get that guy drained right dry. There we go. Should also sell those plates. That'll do. Moving on. Excuse me. Oh, I can't go that way. It's an invisible wall. Keep trying to click on the stick to run. That's not how you do that in this game. Alright, so Majima is reported to be hiding in some large installations that are in plain sight. There's something over here I could check. Guys, I'm just trying to see the sights here. You don't gotta be douchebags. Oh, definitely charge up a lot faster. Down. Thank you. Thank you. So I think he would die faster so I could use my no, no. Oh there was a that's what it was. I got a locker key. Settle your tea kettle! Oh! I said settle your. Oh! Kettle! Kettle settled. I just need to figure out where these Majima installations are. Here they guys get them. Tough. 
Welcome to the lurk. Thank you. I don't have much I can give you, but maybe you'll have a use for this. I got a repair kit. Nice. I'm assuming where I need to go is going to wind up being. I feel like Majima is going to be set up around Theater Square, maybe? Don't see any markers that would indicate where it is. Maybe in front of Millennium Tower? Oh. Didn't check the uh, locker keys I've got. I think I picked up a couple since the last time I was here. Oh yeah. Oh no, maybe I just got one. Ooh, whiskey. For me in Florida. I hear the entrance to that place is a public restroom. Oh, right. Oh. I want to try to find these without a um, naked soldier four. Those are some thugs I would have to fight. Ooh. I obviously, ideally, would like to find these without looking them up. It's more fun that way. Oh, oh. hey, you've changed. That guy, that is. Hey, mister, you got any medicine on you? Ugh, I knew this would happen. He may have done this to himself, but it doesn't look good. Should I get him something to regain him strength? Where's the, uh, I believe the pharmacy's down this way, isn't it? Sort of. All right, let's go to the pharmacy and get him some some medicine. We're out exploring anyways. Maybe? You know, I already bought one I had in my storage and I put it away. Because I remember buying it because I felt like it was a thing I was going to eventually need. Sure what 
you were going for there, buddy, but okay. Ah, uh, pick that up. Thank you. Ooh. It's empty. All I want is another drink. Someone. Anyone. The drunk seems to be really craving another drink. Boy. Hey, you alright? You look pretty wasted. <clears throat> Am I alright? I'm uh, good. Yep. Say. You got any sake, buddy? Man. What? Sake? Ah, yeah. I need another swig. Just gotta wet my lips. You got some or not? Oh. Wait, I don't have any sake on me right now. Oh, are you out too? Make him happy, maybe I'll buy him some. Alright. Uh -huh. Oh, it's right there. Do you have any medicine? Here you go. <clears throat> oh, sure. Have a toughness Z, I guess. Boy. Hey. Uh, Phew, thanks. Feel a whole lot better now. Mm. You can consume a drink, but don't let it consume you. Hey. About that, I'm worried I did some very rude things to you while I was under the influence. Well, a little. Uh. Uh, I knew it. I'm so sorry. Please take this as a token of my apology. Will you accept it? I'll feel bad if you don't. Yeah, no problem. Alertness hood. Every time I drink, I end up like this. Maybe I need to quit drinking for good. Cool. Alcohol is only okay if you don't let it take over your life. Wonder if that man can take his back. I sure do help a lot of drunks in this game. Trophy earned. Um, let's look at that hood. It's an improvement. Helps break down alcohol in your body, allowing you to sober up quickly. C cool. I feel like they sell sake in here? In this pop-up? Or not. Go buy one of those. Yep.
That's the lottery. Cool looking fella. Hmm? Are you talking to me? Hi. Yes, I'm talking to you. What do you want? Um, you don't happen to need work right now, do you? Work. What kind of work. Well, to put it simply, would you be interested in working as an exotic dancer at a banana bar? Whoa! Hey, wait! Why would I subject myself to something like that? With a body like that, why wouldn't you? Keeping that chest wrapped and closed to deny the entire female population. And because you would make money. Lots of money. Please, we don't have enough men right now. And none of them are as hot as you. You'll be doing us a huge favor. Please. Well, fine, I'm sold. Tell me more. Ooh, really? Aw, oh, thanks, fella. What exactly is this all about? Well, it's like a normal bikini bar, but with male dancers, hence a banana bar. Our <laughs> purpose is to charm and entertain female audiences with the paragons of pectoral perfection. I see. Our show's a little provocative. It's our selling point, so if you work for us, you'll be showing off some serious skin. I guess I'll do the best I can. So, first things first, we'll have training and an interview. Can you pay 10,000 yen to cover that? Nani. What? Didn't say anything about paying up front. Eh. True, I forgot to mention that. But don't worry, you'll be able to recoup that investment the first time you flex those pegs. <sighs> okay, I'll pay. Drop in the bucket for me at this point. <laughs> All right, then let's go to your interview and get you set up. Oh, and I haven't asked your name yet. I'm Kiryu. Got it. Sorry for the late introduction. My name's Sasa Sasazuka. Sasazuka? Sasazuka. Uh. <laughs> yeah, nice to meet you. <laughs> okay, then let's go to your interview. I wonder if this guy is legit. I probably should have questioned that before I paid him a large sum of money. Let's see, you're Kiryu-san, yes? My name is Tachibana. I'm important because my name is highlighted. You've already paid for your training, so you can relax. This is a pretty casual interview. Mm. Well, we're the ones who scouted you, and it would be shady of us to take your money without giving you a job. So please, think of this interview as a mere formality. I guess that makes sense. So for starters, could you tell me your strengths? Strengths? What would be useful to them? I'll say... <laughs> I have a manly and beautiful physique. I see, a beautiful physique. I can tell you're quite a man, but what are your finer features? Details, please. Bulging muscles, sweat rolling down my chest as I fight. If I were to compare my body to something, it would be diamond in the rough. Jagged, but enthralling. And a diamond never sparkles more than when another man is attempting to crush it in the heat of battle. When two men clash in combat, that's when our bodies rise to the peak of physical beauty. Uh... Oh my god, it's like your words created an aura of heat around you. Shining bright like a diamond! Guess I got myself kinda pumped. Okay, let's move on to the next question. 
for this interview, what were you doing? What have I been doing? I don't know whether I should tell the whole truth or just say what they want to hear. I guess I can't talk too openly about my past at a legit job. I should say something to muddy to the water. Sorry, but I'm not the type to look back on the past. What's done is done. I hear you, San. It's not really an interview if you don't answer the questions we ask. Well, sure, sometimes reflecting on the past makes you a strong person in the present. But if you do nothing but look backwards, you can never really move forward. I live in the moment. That's why, no matter what happens in the past or the future, I focus on the present. Oh. Wow, I wish I could be as deep as you. <laughs> it happens. Guess I actually succeeded in avoiding the full truth. Okay, so this is the last question. you, san do you remember my name? Ooh, what? This guy's name? It was Tachibana! It was important because it was highlighted! Mm. You were Tachibana-san, right? <laughs> oh, you remembered! Of course. I could never forget a name like that. Yes, well, listening to what someone says demonstrates a respectful attitude. It makes a very good impression. Okay, that concludes the interview. Thank you for coming. Uh. Yeah, thanks. Oh, we have another prospect waiting in the next room, so we'll be in touch. Thank you again, Kiryu-san. <laughs> Shadow! Welcome, buddy. Okay, thanks for coming. That should cover everything. We'll contact you with all the details at a later date. Please come back here soon. I guess I did okay in the interview. Now I just have to wait until they contact me. Sweet. Can't wait to work at the banana bar. Is that the end of the road? Yes, it is. Oh. oh, Kano. Hey, boss. <clears throat> it's me, Kano, your loyal minion. Found this old woman. Mm. Oh, it's you again. Who's the woman? <laughs> Let me tell you, sir, this town is full of beautiful ladies. And I just picked up that one. We're about to get it on. It picked up? Yup. I just said hello and she fell head over heels for me. She's loaded, so I thought I could mooch off of her while I look for a decent way to get a bankroll of my own. And if my job hunt doesn't go well, I'm sure she'll have my back for a while. This woman would support your lifestyle just from hello? She's a prostitute. She's probably not what you think she is. Boss, what are you talking about? Why wouldn't a hot babe with a lot of money fall in love with me at first sight? Anyway, if I find any new cash cows, I'll come and let you know, sir. We're heading for the hotel district. Hotel district? I've got a bad feeling. Sounds too easy. That kid is doomed. My ladies love a man with a giant chin. Down there? Nope. Da, da, da. Oh, what's on here again? <laughs> you alone? That's not for like four more games, guys. Oh, wait, sorry. Please help me! What are you looking at? You want some of this too? I just want to knock you out, actually. Ah, you think that scares me? 
I'll teach you to mind your own damn business. Suck it, Gomez Adams. Sorry, I won't do it again. Thank you so much. Please take this. I got a toughness light. Uh, let's into that road. Whoa. Oh, hey, guys. Yeah, we're just gonna have to do this. I can't get past it. Here's a look. A mysterious syringe. Just injected that dude with a whole lot of meth. This is kind of cozy. You got a fire. There's a relatively nice looking couch right here. Uh, this must be the kitchen area. Oh, no, I guess this is the kitchen area, actually. That must be the, uh, garage? It's a cozy little place you guys got here. Oh, hey, guys. What are you looking at? You want some of this, too? I just want to knock you out. No knives. Take out the trash. Oh, wow. Wow. You're very skilled at not getting hit with trash, sir. Sorry, I won't do it again. Thank you so much. Please take this. I got a gold plate. I'm almost dead. Uh, did the restaurant over here have food? Uh oh. Oh, damn it. I think it was just a bar over here, actually. Oh, there's more of you here than I thought there were. 
Uh oh. No! Oh, I got greedy. Shouldn't have got greedy. Try again. I live in full health, too, so like. Why would I heal? There's gotta be some punishment I'm not seeing for, uh. For getting KO. Personal goal of not continuing after losing. I think of the older games for a trophy or one of the older games anyways. That sounds about right. I'm sure there's going to be some fights where it makes me like reload a save or something. But right now it looks like it just starts you over the beginning of the fight. Hey guys, no, I'm going to leave. Here you lock on, dude. Mago! Anxiety butt? You know what? If you were going to give the anxiety butt, you're correct. Bojack Horseman is exactly what I would expect to show up for that. Taunt him. Also still looking to steal people's anime? I haven't come up with anything better to put for that. Club luxury. Like you are a notorious animo theft. What are you doing here? What happened to that woman? Actually, that's exactly why I needed your help, boss. What is it this time? I uh, need to ask you a favor. Please, sir, can you come with me? No questions asked. Oh, God, Kano, did you kill her? Fine. <sighs> that's not it, but what happened? Oh, you big time, boss. Let's talk somewhere else. I'm always right, Michael. I'm always right. So what is it? Why did we have to come all the way here? Well, uh, it's about that woman I picked up earlier. Uh, yeah. Actually, she was. 
She was the mistress of some Yakuza. She fell for the oldest trick in the book. This one's called a badger game, and I told you to be careful of it. Look at that Daniel Bryan t-shirt. What a mark. Yes. 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 Okay, but we're past that. What can I do about it now? The Yakuza called me and said I had to wait here for him. If I have to face him alone, he's going to fill my shoes with concrete and send me to sink into the bay. Guess I have no choice. I'll help him. So where is this Yakuza? He's already here. He's me. Oi. Hey, Kano, didn't I tell you to come alone? How dare you try to sleep with my woman? Why don't you try and show some dignity in life, eh? AJ is better. Day Don Juan none. 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 Yeah, right. This was your plan from the start, wasn't it? What the hell? Listen, I was willing to come and discuss this so we could resolve things like adults. Uh -huh. But if you don't want to come to the table, that's fine by me. <laughs> so, Kano-san, you gotta pay for damages here. Fortunately, it's only going to cost you four mil to settle this. There's no way I can pay four mil. That's so much money. Boss, please do something. Uh -huh. Boss, who are you, patriarch of the dumbass family? Listen, this stupid kid is new in town. He's young and foolish. Can we just drop this and call it a life lesson? You gotta be kidding, fella. Dumbass man babies like him are fresh meat walking right into the lion's den. <laughs> but it's fine. After I beat you clowns bloody, you'll be begging to pay the damages from your hospital bed. <laughs> He's probably got six extra eyes stored in that giant chin. And since it's two of you, let's double it to eight mil. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh no, I have to find some Yakuza. What will I do? Hey buddy, let's just... Oh, I can't take you to that wall. Oh no! Lay down so I can punch you in the face really hard. Thank you. Ah, now I remember who you are. You are the dragon of Dojima. S say, why don't we just let this one go, eh? I'll even throw some free info in if you don't hold it against me. Mm. And that is... Uh. See, there's a ramen shop called Kyushu Number no. 1 Star. Try ordering ramen with extra soup and a half side of rice from the manager there. He'll give you access to a secret casino that only allows regulars. But if you say the code, you're good to go. Ain't that some great intel? I already know that, dipshit! <sighs> you saved my life, sir. Right. Why do you get me involved in this nonsense? Really sorry, sir. This is a thank you for the trouble. I gathered this money to pay that Yakuza, but it's yours. That's not money. That's a Red Bull. <laughs> Guess money is tricky when it comes to women. Well, you think Red Bull is money, and that's your problem. You need to start using your head. Nobody survives long in this town, falling for every scheme it throws at you. Yes, sir. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks to me, we got info on a secret casino. I already knew about it. I'm disappointed there's not dialogue for me already knowing about it. <sighs> he hasn't learned a damn thing. 
3,000 experience points. Look at, man, I thought experience would be hard to come by. I need to go sell some shit. I got so much crap. Uh, what can I take here? Buff my heat gauge. Buff my heat gauge. Uh, heat gauge will rise when I ev evade an attack. Oh, and uh, buff my heat gauge. Okay. Uh, change battle style for finishing blow. Rally from a damage state by weaving. Put up your guard against when an enemy attacks. Not really a secret casino everyone knows about it. That would be funny, actually. The owner was just like, we'll just let you in. You don't have to keep wasting our time by ordering food we're not gonna you're not gonna eat. Uh running uppercut. Knockdown grab. There we go. They're all up here. I need to open up this tree. I'm using that brawler style a lot, but I, I'm not unlocking anything for it. I'm not using the beast mode a lot. It seems a little, I don't know, awkward. So that's just, uh, let's see, what's this? Yeah, I haven't, I need 50 points to unlock alcoholism. We'll take steel for it, too. <clears throat> That sounds like a good opportunity to save the game. 